Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use MQ135 air quality sensor with your ESP8266 board like Wemos D1, Node MCU, etc. So, this is a air quality sensor of 4 pins where 2 is VCC and ground, it operates in 5 volt, and there is a 10 bit analog to digital converter. That means it will get up to 1023 value of analog pin, and as well as that, there is a digital pin to show you 0 or 1 value depending upon the potentiometer range so in this video i'm going to show you with two kind of display one is spi based tft display and another is i2c based lcd display so let's get started So this is the ST7789 based display and if you do not know how to connect it I have given a video in description and as well as i button do check from there. This is a SPI interface display that you will get a 4 pin of SPI and 2 pin of the 3.3 volt and ground total 6 pin needs to be connected with the pin and here is the A0 and the analog pin I am going to use with the MQ135 air quality sensor so two pins will be a 5 volt and ground this will work in 5 volt and the analog pin is going to connect it with a A0 port of ESP8266 board here I am using OEMOS D1 so if you change the potentiometer value at certain point of analog reading it will be 1 or 0 so you can do it manually using a screwdriver so now go to the code so first of all there is a 4 pin I have decided for the SP interface and this is the main voice setup so here you can see first of all in the setup i have used how to define the air quality text and ppm the static text mainly which is not going to change on the sensor value and in the void loop i am going to give the sensor value so it it will refresh only the void loop that means the variable text area and every time it will be refreshed after five seconds every five seconds so here you can see when i am changing the potentiometer value there is a green LED is going to turn off so it's a manual you can do it so for the digital reading so here you can see normally it is 88 ppm showing this mean analog value ppm in air quality so there is many version is the MQ2 MQ3 on the LPG or some specialized gas for a special purpose but this is only for ppm and air quality sensor so you can use it for detecting a smoke like smoking area in cigarette or etc so normal values there and if you use any kind of cigarette or the stick of any kind of smoke it will increase so you can set your program and this way that after this value increase it will be a buzzer or anything so i'm just showing the value randomly so here is a smoke stick and as soon as i get it closer the smoke is entering the sensor and you can see the value from 88 it increased up to 303 so 330 it will get increased again and again so upon your testing a particular gas that means this gas will produce this kind of value so you can detect a screen for this that this gas has been detected so it will increase 362 as more as smoke is going enter so as soon as you remove it from the smoke area it will take uh, 10 to 5 seconds for returning to the previous option so here you can see it will decrease in the reading 148 136 it is decreasing the reading so it is a SPI ST7789 display of 245 to 40 pixel color display so now let's go to the LCD 1602 16 by 2 LCD so again this code is there I will get the I button link for the setup of this display so very simple so again I am doing that void setup is for static text like air quality and this void loop for only dynamic text that's mean the analog value so I have connected in I2C that means SCL is an SDA 2 pin is there and this display also works in 5 volt and the module or the gas sensor also works in 5 volt. So and other analog pin will be connected and very pretty much same it is. So I am using I2C for the 16 by 2 LCD. So here you can see air quality is showing up there 69, 77. So it will take after boot or after on it will take a uh, around 30 seconds to a stable value so if you found this video helpful do like this video share this video and all the circuit diagram and code is given in my blog all the link will be given and as well as buy link in the given description